Hi, I'm Johnny and as you're here, you've probably watched my previous video where I was making my cardboard VR headset. I showed there how to make your own lenses and you can see this clip right now. And well, those lenses were pretty good but not the best ones you can make. And today I want to show you three types of lenses that I was making. Enjoy! Now you can see how I'm using this setup right now. Okay, so as I want to make freelances, I prepared myself 5 these curved parts and one flat part. I was making them in the same way as in the previous video. So the first lenses I was making were made from these two curved parts and they were glued like you can see here. My second lenses were those you can see in my previous video. They were made from one curved part and one flat part, as you can see here. And finally the third ones, I am using those right now. And as you can see, to make those you will only need those curved parts. Now I am gluing the first type of lenses. As you can see, I left here tiny gap and that's where I will stick my needle later. Now I'm gently squeezing those two parts together. And you shouldn't apply too much force when you're putting those together, because if you do, the glue will fill all the space between our lenses and we don't want that. Now I'm letting it dry for a few hours. And then I'm moving on to the second lens. I'm gluing the sides of the flat part and then I'm covering it with the curved part. And finally the third ones and the best ones I've made so far. Ok, now when the glue finally dried, I'm moving on to fill those lenses with water. I had some troubles with the first lens because when I was gluing them, I might accidentally squeeze them too hard and the glue spread out too much. So I had to trash those and make new ones. I have repeated the last step and this time it worked fine. But as you can see those lenses aren't changing much in your field of view, so I moved on to the second type. So as you can see, I just stuck the needle between the layers and slowly start to pour water in. Then I sealed the hole with healthy amount of glue and let it dry for another few hours. You can also gently tap it a few times to get those bubbles out. And finally the last lenses. Here I am doing basically the same thing I did before. I am trying to find the gap that I left earlier without glue and stick the needle into it. and gluing it for the last time. I have mounted those lenses on a transparent duct tape to be able to adjust their positions if needed. And here it is, my current and best working virtual reality headset. Thanks for watching, I hope you've enjoyed the video. Please leave a comment what do you think about this project and if you want to see more, hit the subscribe button.